Hello, Sister Lock Nation. This is Ebony Crystal. I am doing a video today because of two reasons. One, it's cold in Kansas City. I think we're at 34 degrees. And the other is because of this coronavirus. I'm pretty much not venturing out much. So I thought, well, let me do a one week after installation um, video. And of course, I don't have a clue what I'm doing. It's the first time attempting doing videos. I've done so much research before doing the sister locks. And I've watched so many videos. And I really enjoy them. I'm trying to subscribe to every last one of them that I see. Uh, but like I said, this is just my one week installation. The curls have fallen out quite a bit, which I'm really loving because for me, they were a tad bit too curly. I'm not much on curls, but at any rate, I thought I'd come in and let you all see how this process is going. Uh, I'm really loving this get up and go kind of thing. I'm putting absolutely nothing on my hair other than wearing a cap at night um, I have found a few that are actually started budding on the end already um, I started with 12 inches of hair and she did cut off um, just under an inch because the splint ends are damaged to the ends of my hair I uh, think that and and because I'm not real sure but I'm finding a few that I'm finding little buds on the end and I think that's supposed to be the natural process which is okay with me um, as far as putting anything in my hair no, not doing that um, I am actually at the point of I'm seeing my gray hair and as I've said in previous videos, which is only two, but I have no light gray hair. And I kind of lost a lot of it during the installation process. But I'm beginning to see it coming back. Uh, my hair is super fine in, uh, for number one. And I am at the point where it's kind of getting to a point out I'm losing the sight of the grid. When I first got it installed, you could see a well-defined grid or a lot of scalpage. Well, a lot of that's disappearing. My hair grows relatively fast, and in a week's time, I think uh, there's some new growth in there. I go back for a retightening on April 2nd, and she'll probably have something to tighten up. But... At any rate, I thought I'd come in and let you see, oops, camera's fading out. Again, I told you I don't know what I'm doing. Um, let you see how it's doing as far as how it's looking, how it's going. Uh, the full, well, let me give you the back view as far as this grid is concerned and how it's looking and that my gray hair is showing up. Again, I'm really appreciative of that because I happen to like gray hair. Um, I have been watching a lot of videos, new installations, which I'm really loving. Uh, the process or people that have had been locked a year or two or three and the products or I shouldn't say, well, I guess there are products, the things that they're using. As I understand that the locking process varies and I'm not rushing it whatever time it takes for it to do then I'm okay with it uh, like I said I'm losing some of that scalp that I was seeing when I was first locked but that's okay I've got a baby lock somewhere that she thought might might slip I don't know where it is now uh, but I really don't think it slipped I haven't found any, but I really haven't been doing a, a serious search either. Um, but I am subscribing to just about every channel I look at, only because I want to keep track of what's going on, things that are working for 
one that might not be working for another. And I found that in, in viewing a lot of the videos. Um, and I think the process is one of those things you've got to find because we all have different hair. And as far as things that go on with our hair, uh, they vary. What works for one person will not work for another. And that part I do understand. So as I progress in this journey, I'll find out what's best for me. But I enjoy watching, um, learning your tips, and I've seen some beautiful locks. My daughter and grandchildren, they're locked uh, for about six to seven years, and they have beautiful locks. I mean beautiful. I am thinking at some point, these might thicken up some, which is okay with me, but even if they don't, the fact that they're nice and small works for me. Actually, anything that doesn't require me to get up and do anything works for me. Um, all I do is I do wear a cap at night, and um, that's it. Uh, I've had no pain. Uh, some videos I've seen, you know, they've told me that it was painful or it hurt. My uh, daughter told me the same thing, that even after retightening, it's kind of like it hurts. I haven't had any problems in that area whatsoever. I have had some itching that I more or less just pat it down. Um, and hopefully somewhere in the future I can use, if this persists, I can use something to stop the itching. I'm looking forward to any comments, suggestions, or anything that you guys might have that might help me in this journey. I'm doing this more or less for senior citizens, I guess is the best way to say it. I'm 74 years old, and it's difficult, or getting more difficult, as far as getting my hands up on the top of my head. and. I'm thinking this process is going to eliminate a lot of that. I usually just pull it back in a ponytail and call it a day. But right now, uh, this get up and go works for me. I do have arthritis in my back, and my lower back, and my neck. So that get up shaking business don't work for me. I have to more or less just run my fingers through my hair. Uh, which is okay because it usually just falls and I'm kind of like wherever it falls works for me. Um, again, I am asking uh, any information, any comments, any suggestions as I go along this journey. I don't anticipate any problems, but you never know. Um, I'd appreciate it if you click subscribe on my channel and give me any input, any advice, any tips, any comments. Uh, just hoping that you will enjoy this journey with me. I want to thank everybody that took the time to sit here and watch this old lady as far as what I'm doing, as far as this journey is concerned, and let you know this process works for any age. And so, more or less, I did this for, I'm doing this for, we the senior citizens of these United States and around the world. Again, thanks again for watching. Hit that subscribe button, and I will see you after my retightening. Thanks for watching.